Hi everybody, Colin Cook at Peak Triathlon Coaching here. Just wanted to go through uh, how Final Surge is working along compatible with Zwift and how you can get your files and your workout filter created files over to Zwift. So if we're inside your account here, I put in both a bike file as well as a run file, both uh, in the workout builder format. So we'll go over more with the Garmin Connect piece of it and Garmin IQ uh, in another video. But if we look at this bike file and we click on the little graph button up in the top right at the workout, that is, will only be there if it's a workout builder driven uh, or created workout. But you'll see here, you can get the details on the workout, but you have this little download file option. So if we select that, you can see we have the options to do the .fit Garmin file, Wahoo file, or Zwift, the .cwo file, or even a trainer road file extension there. So for this case, we wanna get this to Zwift. So we're gonna go ahead and click on that Zwift option there. And we're gonna save that file. And now what we need to do is if we go into Finder, and we go to downloads, we should see this file. I've done this a couple of times here, so we can see it a couple of times, but we're gonna go ahead and copy that file. Then we're gonna to go to our documents folder. We're gonna find our Zwift folder, we'll select that. And then we're gonna to go to the workouts folder. And then there's a unique, uh, that is actually your Zwift ID number. So we're gonna go ahead and select that. And then we just need to paste that workout right in here. Uh, please keep in mind that you want to do this before you open Zwift. But once you've done that, now we should be able to go into Zwift. And I did already fire up Zwift to, just to save time here. Um, but now on this home screen, once you've selected all your devices and you're ready to go, you just click on this training tab. And then you'll see this workout option here where you can come down and you can select any one of the workouts. Um, Threshold Builders was the one that I was using in this example here. So you've got that file and you can adjust your FTP here if you want. Hopefully it should be set accurately and it is driven, the workout is driven off of percentages of your FTP. So it is important that you have this set up correctly and you can actually adjust it here if you want to. Um, so that is how you can get that set. And then we just click workout and then we can go into the ride. Also, if you are gonna be riding as part of a group ride and you'd like to still follow your workout or the workout is, is based on that, you can do that. What you have to do is you have to go in and actually join the group ride and then uh, exit out or go into the menu here and go to workouts and select that workout. But that will allow you to still ride with others and execute on the workout. So let me know if you have any questions, but hopefully that should take care of and get you going here. Thanks a lot.